and you find everything about you. Now, uh, as a visual artist, I've got a different website, which is more interesting, uh, let's say, because now I live in St. Ives, so obviously, you know, you need to have, like, a, your portfolio and things. So it's like my visual artist website is www.mysite is the best, slash, dash, slash, dash, dash. I've got a lot of shaggy hair and beautiful big glasses, slash, dash, dash, dash. So chicks just adore me. Dollar, yen, pound, dollar. I sell everything. The moment I finish, every single canvas is sold. Slash, dash, 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 dot, dot, colon, semicolon, semi, 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 semicolon, semi, semicolon, colon, dot, dot, dot. Slash, slash, dash, slash, you shut, slash, 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 <laughs> yeah, I've got a poem for uh, this uh, stupid uh, American Yankee, stupid Halloween thing. Yeah. It doesn't belong to our culture, but anyway, because we have to sell stuff, we we got it. Yeah. So I got this poem uh, as a uh, multilingual poet. I like to write in animal language as well. You know, I just. For example, for this occasion, I, I can do like a poem uh, that I've written in bat language. <laughs> so, because as a bat language, I'm not, I'm not a batman, <laughs> but I'm a man bat. So, it's basically a, a bat that pretends to be a man. <laughs> so, and the poem is uh, it's called the uh, it's called the autumn budget. It goes like this. <laughs> Obviously, you can't hear it because uh, this is back language. <laughs> but anyway, coming to Christmas, I don't know what happened to me. I get scared. I'm, I'm really panicking. Uh, probably because. Um, uh, in my previous life, I was a turkey. So I got a, <laughs> so, uh, so I got a poem in Turkey language, just like Tur not Turkish, Turkey as a Turkey the animal. And uh, and the poem uh, it goes like this, and then I tell you, I, I translate as it goes. It goes like this. <laughs> Is Brexit? Brexit. The, co the, co the poem is about Brexit, and it's called "I Vote for Christmas." <laughs> and it goes Language is pages and pages of stuff. <laughs> <laughs> That's why I'm doing it for me. <laughs> Can't just say no. You cannot become part of a wonderful thing, which is tide, the tide. 
It's just a, yeah, it's this rhythm of it. And uh, so I've written this poem, uh, which is called Utopic Tidal Eunoia. Eunoia is a beautiful, the shortest uh, English word with all the vowels. Eunoia, E-U-N-O-I-A. A known place for the sheer pleasure of doing something. For instance, looking after the tide. Tide after tide after tide, tide after tide after tide, tide after tide after tide, tide tide after tide. One at a time, no matter how long the short time is, one at a time, like breathing and tide, it happens within the vastness of our mindfulness, as if our the moons were tired in the open ocean. Therefore, we don't know nothing. Therefore, we don't know nothing. We don't know in the oscillations. Joy after joy, joy after joy, sorrow, sorrow. Joy, joy, sorrow, sorrow, after joy, joy, after sorrow, 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 for joy, after joy. The punchline in poetry never comes when you expect it. And there is a delay where an immeasurable thing happens between Thank you.